Uh, so, of course, it is mid-October, which is my favorite month, not just because it's my birthday month, but it's because when fall is undeniably in the air, Cisco is in the garden. He invited me to join him, and I should warn some of you, what you're about to see might be very, very scary, but oh. probably not. <laughs> La la! Only kidding! <laughs> but hey, it is Halloween, so we're gonna make a spooky pot that's gonna scare the living Tweedle out of those trick or treaters. So, when it comes to plant selection, I'm looking for some spooky looking plants that fit with the colors of the season. So, this is a real favorite of mine called Equisetum, and uh, this is a horsetail, a big horsetail. Is there anything scarier than that? Of course, you gotta add a couple little scary spiders on there. Oh, la, la. <laughs> this one is called Karokia, and doesn't this look like it should be in a haunted house garden, you know? Everyone that sees it goes, is that dead? Oh, what could be better than that? These are ornamental peppers. You can eat them, but you'd have to be crazy to do it. It burns the geezer hair right out of your ears. Sounds like a dare. <coughs> You're right. <coughs> Black is so nice and morbid. <laughs> Black mondo grass. And what is cooler than a gourd covered with warts? Ooh, yuck. Now, when it comes to assembly, put the tallest ones in the middle and then the next highest ones around. Oh, I love this euchre for great color in here. Always use odd numbers. It looks more natural. Uh, Chris, you sure you don't want one more before <laughs> I plant this? No, I wanted a treat. That was a trick. And then finish with some things that'll creep over the side. Some spooky looking wire vines. Oh, yeah. <laughs> My favorite little black widow spider. Oh, la, 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 la. Boo, la, la. A true Halloween masterpiece. Oh, this is a true Oh, oh my God. I don't know what to say. I don't know what's better, like Cisco or Chris's editing and storytelling on it. Like, it's just. Uh, it, well, it's a pretty fun collaboration because, of course, he's the expert. Surprises. He's got all the stuff laid out, and I always say, okay, so tell me what we want to do. He's like, a Halloween basket. I'm like, okay, all right. So, what if we do this? What if we make it a monster movie and say it came from the garden, and his wheels get going, uh -huh. he gets excited? I reference the, what about Boo La La? And he, oh, lost it. <laughs> Pop rocks came out of his head, so uh, thanks to Cisco, he always makes time oh, for us. Sure. Uh, and we have uh, another one in the can, as we say in the TV business, because the sun was out, it was so beautiful. Mm -hmm. He says, yeah. hey, you want to do one more? I said, yes, I do. Nice. So we've got that coming up next. Oh, That's nice. Awesome. Yeah. That energetic off camera, too. All the time. All the time. All the time. He is a joy to be around, absolutely. Yeah. Aw. Yeah. Yeah.